Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Glory and I'm a curly hair enthusiast on Instagram and here on YouTube. You guys can already tell by the title, this video is going to be a little bit different from what I usually post. You know, I'm very transparent on my channel and I like to be honest with you guys. So, in today's video, we're going to be reviewing the Rizzo's Curls Light Hold Gel. But before we go ahead and get started, if you like videos like these, sure to go down below and subscribe to my channel. Also, make sure to follow me on all of my social handles. I'll leave the link down below. Follow me especially on my Instagram because I do like to do polls and interact with you guys a lot and answer your questions. So make sure you go ahead and follow me on there as well. Let's just go ahead and get started with this video. So as I said in today's video, we're going to be reviewing the Rizos Curls Light Hold Gel. So this gel does retail for $19.99. First off, can we talk about the packaging because this packaging is so cute. I really hope that they switch all of their packaging to this because this is literally adorable. If you don't know what Rizos Curls is, it's a Latina owned hair care brand. It's owned by Julissa on Instagram. Um, I will go ahead and link down below the Instagram, their handles. I have used Rizos Curls products before. I love their deep conditioner, their curl cream. They both literally work amazing. Um, I have not used their shampoo, mostly because I used it one time and I did not know that it contained sulfate because they always preach that their products have no sulfates, no parabens, no silicone. And the shampoo actually does have sulfates and I don't like using sulfates because I feel like it irritates my scalp. And although it does say on the bottle it doesn't contain sulfates, it does. And I don't really like the fact that they aren't honest with that. But I really love their deep conditioner and their curl cream. Although once I was finished with them, I did not repurchase them because I'm a girl who loves hold. I love hold and I want my hair to last me for days. So because they never released the gel, I kind of just gave up on the brand and did not repurchase any of their products until now. About three weeks ago, they went ahead and released their Rizos Curls Light Hold Gel. This contains aloe vera, which is deeply hydrating and regenerating and helps prevent breakage. They have flaxseed in it, which is supposed to nourish and protect with vitamin E. And it also contains thyme, which is known to promote healthy hair growth. The whole gel is sealed in moisture and it offers flexible, flake-free hold and definition. So I was so excited to use this, especially because it does contain flaxy gel. And if you have been following my channel for a while, you know one of my favorite, absolute favorite flaxseed gels is this one. This is the Pure Flaxy Gel from Curl Mix. So since I love this product so much and I've also seen a lot of really good reviews on the Rizos Curls Light Hold Gel, I said, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. So I went and spent my coin and I got it. I think I purchased it about a week ago. The first thing I did was I went right in to try this product out. I have some thoughts. So let's just go ahead and begin. Okay, so I went ahead and washed my hair. I used the Curlsmith Vivid Tones Vibrancy Shampoo and I used the Maui Moisture Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter Hair Mask. I love this mask so much. These products are so good. I parted my hair and I'm ready to proceed with styling. Now, I did read the back of this and it does say it's meant to be used with the Curl Defining Cream. And you guys know I said in the beginning I don't have the curl defining cream because I did run out and I never really repurchased it because I'm the type of person that I really like to use a whole line and I like for it to have a gel so since they never really released the gel I kind of just gave up on the line um, their products are really good I'm a hold kind of girl and none of the products really gave me hold they just gave me a lot of moisture and like a fluffy wash and go which I'm not really used to I'm going to go ahead in and find a curl cream that works well with this so then I can apply that first to my hair and then use this as like a finishing touch. So while editing the file would not load so I don't have um, me styling my hair but I do have the aftermath so here you go. My hair is completely styled and I have some thoughts. While I was applying the products, 
is my pattern beauty styling cream before this product is super moisturizing for my hair hence the curl defining cream from Risos curls is very moisturizing that's why I decided to use that product um, but after I'm done styling um, and using the gel my hair feels really dry like really dry like as if I use the product with alcohol and there's obviously no alcohol in these ingredients so I'm not sure exactly why my hair feels so dry it has aloe vera flaxseed and thyme and I do use a flaxseed gel from curl mix this is my favorite flaxseed gel and this is from curl mix and my hair feels so hydrated after using this product. I love how it feels in my hair. Bring it to the Rizos Curls Gel. My hair feels really dry. Like really dry. Kind of scared. <laughs> so at this point I was trying to do anything I could to get this hair to curl. I started using my microfiber towel and scrunching. I also tried applying a little bit more of the product and nothing was working my hair was actually almost dry at this point there was no going back you guys know i've done many 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 product reviews on this channel and typically my hair looks a lot more juicy and my curls start coming in but my hair feels really dry and it looks dry to be honest <sighs> is not going to be a good wash day like I'm so terrified because I have like stuff to do and I don't I really don't want to rewash my hair but from how my hair feels I really feel like I'm going to have to wash my hair again I'm going to go ahead and diffuse my hair and I'll be back to share with you guys how my hair looks how I'm feeling about it I'm just so scared to be honest like, so I'll be back so I'm going to go ahead and insert some pictures here of what my hair looked like after using the Light Hold Gel from Rizos Curls. So as you can see, my hair was looking so dry. This was my hair diffused. There was no volume. There was no definition. My hair felt like I had poured a bottle of alcohol on it. It was just so dry, so stringy. I did not like it. I know I don't have the most perfect hair. I'm aiming to get my hair back to its usual health, but I've never had a product work as bad as this one. And I use a lot of product, guys. And I am very transparent when it comes to products that don't work for me. I do like to answer your questions on my Instagram. And if there's anything you have questions about, if the product worked for me, I will tell you if it did not work for me. This product did not work for me. It probably is one of the worst products I've ever tried. And it's really upsetting because I had such high hopes for it because like I said, I love their curl cream, their deep conditioner. It's They are so moisturizing. So I was expecting a lot of moisture coming from this product and a lot of hold. And from the reviews that I've seen, I've seen nothing but good things. So that's why I'm so surprised at the fact that this didn't work. I really wish it did work on me, but it didn't work. And honestly, from what I see, some people like it. So maybe it would work for you. But you guys know I love to give you, I'm giving you my own experience, my own advice. I did not like this product. This was, to me, a waste of money. And like, I don't know if I'll probably give this to my mom. I probably won't even give this to anyone I know because I really didn't like it. It's honestly the worst $20 I've spent. I do not like this product at all and I don't recommend it, especially if you have a blonde hair because it just did not work for me. It did not work for me at all and I do not like it. I'm sorry, like I don't want to be mean. I do like their conditioner and their curl cream, but this was a huge no for me I did not like the way it made my hair feel it literally felt like there was alcohol in it if you're looking for like a light hold gel that has flaxseed i highly highly recommend the pure flaxseed gel from curl mix i believe this retails for 27 dollars but it's honestly so much worth it i'd rather spend the extra seven dollars than purchase this product ever again honestly this is amazing and i think i'll stick to her she works good i love this product so much but if you watched this video all the way through, thank you so much for watching. I know this is something usually very different on my channel, but um, 
I just really did not like the product and I feel like I needed to share it with you guys before you went ahead and purchased it. To give you my honest opinion and thoughts on how I felt on my hair. If you've tried it and it actually has worked for you, please comment down below. I don't know why it did not work on my hair to be honest. I've never really had an issue with any gels like that so this is why it was pretty surprising for me. If it did work for you, please comment down below in the comment section. And if you enjoyed watching this video, I don't know if you guys would like me to do kind of like products I don't like type video because I do have many products I don't like and did not work for me. So. Let me know if that would be something you'd be interested in. But I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give your girl a big thumbs up and go down below and subscribe to my channel. Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!